Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Mary Ellen Pan. Well, hopefully you enjoyed yesterday with the sunshine and nice temperatures, comfortable conditions, because uh, today is going to be a bit different. We're dry right now, may see even a little sunshine, uh, but the wet weather is on its way in and it's going to make for a gloomy, chilly day today with highs staying in the 60s. We're going to see drier air move in for the week and we're just, temperatures will be back up to near average, which is about the upper 70s this time of the year. And it's going to be a stretch of temperatures near average or just above. And it does look like the last week of summer after today is going to end on a dry note. And we need rain. There's some areas that are out pretty dry, moderately dry, like Adams County. Right now, we still have mostly clear skies over our eastern areas, partly cloudy to mostly cloudy farther to the west. And you could see the clouds starting to really thicken up and showers are also going to be moving in. They're still off to the southwest. So as we go through the morning hours, the clouds will be building in and showers will be developing. I would say anytime after 9 30, 10 o'clock, and then we're with the showers all throughout the day. Scattered showers, cooler temperatures staying in the mid to upper 60s to near 70 degrees. Mostly cloudy. There could be a few lingering showers overnight tonight. Temperatures drop back into the mid and upper 50s. And then tomorrow, sunshine does return, mixing with some cloud cover. I can't rule out an isolated shower because we still have the upper level energy to move through and a cool front. Temperatures, though, mid to upper 70s. So a much nicer start to the work week. In terms of the rain chances today, the best chance is going to be from noontime into the afternoon. That's when we're going to see the more moderate rain and more widespread rain. And then it starts to taper as we head towards the evening and into the overnight period. In your weather and health today, pollen levels are low, mold levels are moderate, but the air quality is good and that UV index is definitely running low with an hour of burn time, one hour to burn. All right, temperatures right now looking good. Look at it as we check outside oh, all the colors there in our Lancaster Sky Cam. You can see we've got some uh, blue skies there. The sun is coming up, so you will see some sunshine here this morning, but those clouds will thicken up. Temperatures right now 54 in Harrisburg, 53 in Carlisle. We have upper 40s in in York and in Lebanon, Lewistown also in the 40s. Winds are nice and calm, a little bit on the light side there in Chambersburg and in Lancaster. So we've got one system that'll pass by to our south. This is what's going to bring the showers for much of the day today. And then this system comes through tomorrow. That's why we have that isolated chance. That's with the upper part of this uh, two part series here. Predictors showing those showers coming in, I would say after 9 30, 10 o'clock, still dry in our eastern areas, but then the rain will move across the area moderate times as we head into the afternoon. Still seeing those showers hit or miss as we get into the evening and even part of the overnight period we could have some of those uh, showers still lingering especially in our eastern areas then tomorrow while we see the sunshine return some upper level energy and some cooler air in the upper levels could spark an isolated shower too but most everybody will stay dry and then tuesday looking good as high pressure builds in maybe a bit on the breezy side winds coming out of the northwest but i do anticipate lots of sunshine and a nice looking day with temperatures in the mid 70s, so not too bad. Rain amounts, well, this just updated. <laughs> Anywhere from a half an inch to three quarters of an inch, and there could be some isolated amounts, maybe approaching an inch if you get under pockets of more moderate rain. But then the rest of the week is quiet. We've got sunshine, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Temperatures in the upper 70s. We're near 80 on Friday with increasing clouds. And then next week, and fall arrives on Saturday, and it looks like more rain heads our way as we head into the fall season, especially Sunday and Monday. All right, thanks, Mary.